Hi Pisces, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please comment below if it resonates with you, okay? Alright, so Pisces, this week you may just be um, trying to look at things from a different perspective. And so you can come to a different outcome, a different conclusion or resolution to some situation, some person, some you know entity you're really waiting for the other shoe to drop here um or waiting for clarity to to have that aha moment in regards to okay i get it this is what's going on it's almost as if life is going on around you um and you're just watching it suspended animation Where you just see things happening. It's almost as if you can see it before it happens. Having an increased foresight for the people around you in, in regards to their life or just life in general. But feeling some type of way and feeling like you are above what is going on and you already knew or you already know it's happening or it will happen maybe even having a higher and elevated you know sense of what is to come you know your thoughts are far beyond sur surpassing what is right now and this could be in regards to love or just life in general but just feeling like you're on the outside looking in let's see what the situation is this week page of cups and a four of pentacles so there could be somebody younger than you in your life that you're dealing with you're trying to hide away or like keep something away or stow away it can even be money it could be even your energy your time you're not giving to this connection you could be trying to save your money you could be penny pinching you could be very emotional some relationship is going to the next level like there's getting there's going to be a status change here uh, there's going to be some title to the relationship it's like you want to hold on to someone or something it's like you saw this coming or, or vice versa somebody's trying to hold on to you or you're still holding a torch for somebody who may even have left your life I'm not saying they left earth they're, they're dead or anything but they're not in your life actively um, but you're still holding the torch for them Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio they still have some level um, some higher level in your life you're coming up as yourself this week seeing things from a different perspective waiting for the shoe to drop waiting for what you know to happen waiting for it to actually happen you could be dealing with the younger cancer Pisces Scorpio you keep holding you hold you're holding a torch for someone you're holding on to someone as you can see they're not holding on to you um, but the advice this week Knight of Wands the world you're holding on to somebody but the the um, the advice is for you to it's gonna be an opportunity for you to move on to move into something new to go after your own desire because some 
a chapter in your life is closed. Maybe in regards to a Leo, Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio. It's time for you to just energetically move in a new direction. There's going to be some new perspective, new opportunity that comes to you rather quickly. It's going to allow you to close a door or close, go to the next chapter. Start a new, go on a new, new journey here. The door is closed in regards to some, someone. Maybe you didn't get a response from someone or someone is in and out. They respond or, or they interact, connect with you, contact you when they want to. It's allowing you to see things from a different perspective. Um, the hangman. Allowing you to see things from a different perspective here. It, it's not that they're too busy or um, they're so, the, the ratio of men or women, men and women in your city is off or that they're still you know it's not any of that it's the fact that maybe this this chapter of your life is closed with this person with this entity with this thing this is a person though um it's closed it's done you may see this person for a while you're expecting some money from someone or some yeah you know, the outcome here is the Ten of Pentacles and the Seven of Wands. So you're going to because. Oh shit. The outcome is. Someone choosing to stay with their family in their marriage, in their relationship. They're keeping you at bay. They're keeping you. They're keeping you boxed in, in that corner. Ten of Pentacles, Seven of Wands. It's like they're choosing to stay with what they they're con they're concerned about their reputation. They're concerned about their public appearance in regards to relationship and marriage. So they may be keeping. It could be a fire sign. It could be earth sign, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, uh, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. They're con they're keeping the relationship in a corner or they're 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 fighting off or they're holding back it's almost as if you knew this you knew this person would choose their family over you a family life over you Some additional advice in here. Some of you are holding on to a friendship, the feelings about a friend that you have, and it's going to be an opportunity for you to go ahead and either speak your truth passionately um, and go to the next level, next chapter with this person. And for some of you, it can turn into a, an actual physical relationship, a marriage, um, something that you, you, you pray for. What is this? Forgiveness. Ask your angels. Perfect timing. Look for a sign. Something is over. It's like something has to transition into either new or it has to be over. There's something better. Okay. Pisces, I hope that this reading resonated with you. If it did, go over to the website. Book your own reading there. Thank you, Pisces. Take care and many blessings to you.